So does the uh, white frontage, or should I say, does a uh, landed property with a white frontage uh, means that this landed property will be valued higher than a landed property with a narrow frontage? So don't be misled by the feature selling for some agents because if we actually know about setback requirements, for example, an inter terrace with a 10 meters white frontage. After deducting the setback requirements of seven and a half meters from the front and the two meters at the back, we are essentially losing approximately 95 square meters of land that cannot uh, that we cannot actually build on because of the setback requirements versus a plot of inter terrace that has approximately six meters frontage. We are losing approximately say 60 square meters of space that cannot be built due to the setback requirements. Essentially, this would mean that we can generate a much larger build-up area for a terrace house with a narrower frontage. So before you are being misled by agents that says that uh, landed homes with wider frontage has better value, think about this. All in all, frontage with matters when it will affect the layout of the property. So I hope this will clear the air for many buyers out there who is looking at lender properties. And if you have further questions, do feel free to sound off in the comments or get in touch with me personally to clarify. Once again, this is Gerald from Orange T AAG Lender 7772, your compass for lender properties, signing off.